How is it going out there, everybody? This is Speedboy14 on my playthrough of Super Mario 3D World for the Nintendo Switch. Last time we did um, the dreaded Star World. The Star World took a little longer than I thought it would, but thankfully it was still doable as a one-parter. But now we're in the Mushroom World. So, um, and this world should take nowhere near as long, hopefully. Um, I don't even have to practice these levels, because I know these levels aren't really that difficult anyway. Um, so, um, if you guys give me a favor and drop a like on this video, I'd really appreciate that. We did the Star World last time, and it was quite a slog. If, and if you're new to my channel, don't forget to click that subscribe button and click on the bell to be notified every time I make new videos. If you sign a feature of the channel, you can request your favorite world or favorite level of the game in the comments below. Also, let me know down in the comments below for a question of the video. What what game do you predict might be game of the year of 2023? I know it'll be a while before 2023 is over, but what game do you predict might be game of the year? Do you think Tears of the Kingdom might be game of the year? Or do you think Super Mario Bros. Wonder might be game of the year, or what? Excuse me. We're going to do the Mushroom World. There's 10 green stars in this mystery house here. Mystery House Brawl. <laughs> Here we go. Should be easy. We just have to defeat the enemies here is all we gotta do. Okay. There we go. Shouldn't be too hard. Yeah, these mystery houses are easy, like I said. They're easy. They're pretty simple. They're not hard. The Mushroom World is very easy, like I said. I thought we would do this first. I can't believe I got hit right there, but that's all right. I'm trying to save my cat suit for whenever I need it. Oh no! failed on a mystery house. These mystery houses are not, this is not even that hard. I'm normally not that bad at the mystery houses. pronunciation for that word is actually comic. Okay, let's collect all these coins. One more star left. We can do this. There are no stamps in the mushroom world, so that makes them so that makes the mushroom world really, really easy since there are no stamps. And these levels are really short too. Like they're not hard. Mm 
Now we're gonna go ahead and do Mushroom Dash 1. All right, Night Falls on really rolling heels. This level is actually really easy right here. You have a short time limit here, but it's super easy. I'm looking for the green stars, uh, because I can't memorize them all. I can't memorize all of them, but I'm looking for them. That's one of them. See, I told you. I told you. This is not hard at all. Are you kidding me? I attacked them. You better not do this to me. We'll get introduced to a new power up pretty soon. That's gonna be really cool. All these levels are easy in the motion world. I think for the flower world, since that world is so long, I might just have to wise up and break it into more parts like I said last time. Maybe into at least two parts. Okay, so we're done with the first level of the mushroom world. Now we're going to the second level. This is actually a pretty easy level. This is where we get introduced to a newer version of the cat suit. I can't wait to show it to you. There's nothing up here. At least there's some coins here. Excuse me, so I can kill these guys. If you hit this power block, you'll get the new power up. It's actually the lucky bell where you can ground pound it, this one, like I'll show you from a high a little bit of a higher distance to actually get some coins. You can ground pound with it to get some coins. You can make yourself invincible for a little bit when you ground pound with it. It's really cool. I like it. I really like the power up. Okay, so we can go in here. And we have two. We have to collect all these coins. There we go. That's our second green star. <clears throat> Not too difficult at all. Come on. what tree you have to climb to get to. Or oh, that works. I know the last key coins up here. Look how many coins you can collect if you do a high ground pound from really high. 
You can collect a lot of coins with this power up. That's, I love this power up. Another power up I really like is the gold flower from New Super Mario Bros. 2. That's definitely one of my favorites. I can't wait for the new Mario game to come out, which is Super Mario One, Super Mario Bros. Wonder, because I'm definitely going to do a playthrough of it when it comes out. And I, if the, whenever the new 3D Mario game comes out, I'll definitely do a playthrough of it too. It'll be awesome too. Alright, so I'm glad we got introduced to this new power up. The mushroom world's easy, like I told you. This world is not hard at all. Um, so uh, now we're gonna go ahead and do Mushroom Dash 3 Deep Black Jungle Drift. This one's actually a pretty easy level too. It's a dark level, but at the same time it's pretty easy. You can use the light box here, which I'm not gonna play as Luigi because you can easily just do this play as Mario. Trying to get that green star and come back. I should have just waited for another platform. I don't really like to wait too long. Okay, this is where the first green star was. All right. So, um, now we're gonna go ahead and do Mushroom Dash Four, which is Trouble and Shadow Play Alley. This one's gonna be a quite interesting level. It's a pretty easy level, but at the same time, you do have 100 seconds on the clock, but. It's not a difficult level, but it is interesting. Okay, I messed up at that. There's a way you can get that green star that way. Ah! Oh. Wild jump, come on! I was thinking you can long jump into this, but I guess Mario is too tall to do that. Maybe with small Mario you can, let's try it. Ah! Why, are, why is this game so slippery with the controls? Mario wasn't this slippery in the Wii U version of this game. Makes it harder for me to time jumps right. Okay. It, 
You can do that with small Mario, but only with small Mario and not with big Mario. I wish you could with big Mario and stuff like that. Okay. Controlling! Mario is a lot more slippery in this game than what he was in, um, than what he was in the Wii U version of this game. <laughs> oh, I know. Oh, I don't know why I'm struggling here. I'm good at this game. I know I am. I'm good at Super Mario 3 World, like I've said several times. I don't want to struggle with this game. I want to be. I want to do good. Explode! Explode! Thank you. Okay. This might be the hardest level in the Mushroom World since I thought about it. I want to get the top because this is a 100% playthrough. And I'm going for the 100% completion. <clears throat> I'll have to replay it again. Can you give me a cat suit? Thank you. I'm saving the cat suit. I don't want to use it up. I don't. I'm saving it just in case if I get hit. Mushroom World ain't really that hard. Okay, so we have to use the touch controls here. Okay, so we have to do this, so this level's so easy. Ah. Hold on to this baseball just in case we need it. Because we have touch controls. Possible we won't even need it. Okay, so. I know we do need it for something. Just to get this green star right here. Excuse me. 
Okay, so... There's gonna be a tricky one right here to get this green star. Ah! Oh. That, that green star is gonna be a little bit tricky. Okay, let's try again. Come on, hurry, hurry, hurry. No! We can't even try again if we mess up. That's what sucks about this. I hate those green stars like that. I hate that it's precise timing. And if you mess it up, you cannot retry again. It sucks! This is the mushroom world. It's supposed to be the easiest of the special worlds. Okay. I'm glad we got it. We have to go inside this warp box to get our third green star. We have 300 green stars now. We're done with that level, so... We're going on to Mushroom Dash 6. Gigant gigantic Seasick Wreck. We got our first two green stars. Uh, okay. Okay, so we do this, and then we long jump, and there we go! Top of the flagpole! I told you, this world's super short. I told you, this video was gonna be a really short video, I told you. I know we died a couple times, but it wasn't like I'd say rage inducing or anything like that. Because this world's really easy, like I said. The flower world's really easy too, but it, it does have some difficult levels from time to time, but. But the flower world's usually pretty easy for the most part, but I still think I'm gonna split it up into more parts because the flower world's just too long for one video. 
and now I don't want my video to be super long. Even the Star World was fairly long, and it was still doable as a one-parter. So, Broken Blue Bully Bell. Okay, this level's a pretty easy level here. Uh, probably one of the hardest levels in the game. You have no idea what you're doing. In my opinion, I think it's an easy level, because I know why I'm doing it. Excuse me. Um, I think it's an easy level because it's, it's an easy level like I said they give you the Tanuki suit and the Tanuki suit makes this level really easy without the Tanuki suit this level I'm not, I don't, it's not difficult without it but at the same time it does make it more difficult than what it usually is but with the Tanuki suit this level is super easy I thought this level was really hard when I first played it, and it turned out to be one of the easiest levels in the special world. Because this level is really, really easy. This is a level I love to speedrun, too. Speedrunning this level is also really easy. I have done speedrun. This is a, I think I have done speedruns on this level before. very easy I told you it may not look like it, it may not look like it's as easy as it is but at the same time it's just super duper easy not difficult at all there we go <laughs> I don't think I even died once on Mushroom Dash 7 that's how easy this level is. Even when you're small Mario, it gives you a Tanuki suit. Did you guys know that? Now we unlock the path to the flower world. The flower world will, will be next time. All right, guys, that's it. Thank you very much for watching, guys. If you enjoyed, don't forget to drop a like. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to click that subscribe button and click on the bell. Be no by the time I make new videos. I'm actually gonna record the at least the first part of the flower world today. I'm guaranteeing this world's gonna be more than one part. It's gonna be at least two parts. It's just too long for one video. It's not a difficult world, but it's just too long for one video. Um, so, and have a wonderful day. Peace, Republic of Speedboy.